doubts in ghusl. If one is not sure whether he or she has performed ghusl at all, he or she must perform it. If one doubts before completing the ghusl whether he washed a certain part of the left side or not, he only needs to wash that part. However, if after starting to wash one of the three parts of ghusl, one doubts whether he has washed some or all the previous parts, he should disregard that doubt, such as doubting about the head and neck after starting to wash the right side. If we realize after performing ghusl that a part of the body was not washed because we forgot or because of something that prevents water from reaching the skin and it is on the left side of the body, we only need to wash that part of the body with the intention of ghusl. And if it was on the right side, after washing that part, we must wash the left side over again. The reason for this is that washing the left side is only correct if the right side has been completely washed. The washing of a body part is only correct if the previous parts are washed completely. If the part that was not washed is on the head or neck after washing that part, we must wash both sides of the body starting with the right side. Of course, this rule only applies to Tardibi Ghusl because according to many marjas, if one speck of the body is not washed while performing Ertamasi Ghusl, the whole Ghusl is invalid.